Hey guys, welcome back to another vloggy vloggy vlog. <laughs> you guys, it is currently Sunday night and we're starting the vlog really late. It's currently 8.50. We actually just got home about 10 minutes ago. We did go to Babe's friend's son's first birthday party. And yeah, we were there for only about an hour. But we just got home and fun fact, my husband's brother is actually how do you say that babe my husband's brother's girlfriend is actually my husband's baby mama's sister does that make sense long story short your my kids brother girlfriend and a baby mama's sister right yeah. that makes sense but yeah you guys anyway so long story short we went to the birthday party and we seen them over there nana and elijah do spend time with like their tia and tia over there a lot so we actually see them right now they got to hang out and spend time with nana and elijah on a sunday which is pretty weird because usually like we always say we don't have the kids on the weekend we just saw the kids and we did give elijah his backpack right now long story short what a oh my god <laughs> <laughs> you guys a long story short what I'm trying to say is we just seen the kids so we gave Elijah his backpack and we filled it with all of his school supplies but I'm getting Evan's backpack this is the one that he picked for this school year and then it does come with a little pencil case or whatever and then this is Chubb's backpack his backpack is honestly like my favorite Chubb's picked out a little demon slayer backpack and I feel like it looks a lot different than the boys but it looks Super cute, super cool. So I'm gonna fill up their backpacks and get everything ready for tomorrow. Oh my God, I'm getting so mad. No, I'm mad. Are you right? You're laughing at me because I'm frustrated. Yeah, I'm mad. Yeah, fuck. Mom, I'm mad. I'm mad. Okay, girl! <laughs> Babe, how do you feel that we're able to like go around your brother and stuff now? It's great, huh? Yeah. What'd you say? You suck! Yeah. You suck. Y'all both suck. Y'all both stink right now. You stink. And don't get me started about stinking. You wanna go there? Uh. Anyways, you guys, I just got a bunch of paper notebooks composition notebooks i'm just gonna throw like one of each in their backpacks for now and then their teachers can obviously take whatever they need so i just got some highlighters a pack of pencils and these ones are unsharpened wow oh, i usually sharpened. get the sharpened ah. i also did get some dry erase markers for their teachers some hand sanitizer some scissors how many glue sticks did you give Elijah? Two or three? Two. Two? Let's see. And then you guys see these on a previous vlog where I got these like a month ago. Oh! I keep fucking myself up. I'm getting so mad. I hit myself with my elbow. Mama, get your big head out of my frame. Hello. Hi. But yeah guys, we just got some colored pencils, some markers, and some crayons that I'm going to throw in their backpacks. And low-key, you guys, I bought like extra as I do every year. So I'm going to have a whole closet full of like school supplies, markers. <laughs> I can't stand you. You can't stand it because you're just Can you just look at me up and down? Because we can fight. She can't stand you because you're just like her. Yeah. I have to deal with you, though. Okay, you're the most blessed man in the world. <laughs> no, since I wasn't, but I'm still saying I have to deal with two of y'all. Yes. And we got to deal with you. And these stinky ass awesome boys. Oh, brother. Okay, boys, let me see your outfit. Today's the first day of school, and the boys are looking cute or whatever. Supposedly, the boys got haircuts with their dad. Mm. It just doesn't look like you got a haircut. But it's fine. You still look handsome. You ready? Yeah. Usually Chubb's hair looks super clean and I don't really know what's going on here, but listen to me, both of you. Have a good day at school. Be respectful. And I love you guys so much. 
it is a couple hours later from earlier what you guys seen obviously the boys go to school for the first day i feel like the summer went by really really fast and it's gonna feel weird just having Alea here throughout the whole day because i'm so used to like all the kids the chaos the noise i did feed her breakfast we ate together probably about an hour ago and we were just downstairs chilling but we're gonna get our day started you guys if i were to show you guys how bad my house is i usually deep clean and do like that whole thing on friday if not sundays but this last friday and sunday i didn't freaking do it because we were busy both days so i'm like super behind on so much like i woke up feeling super anxious because not only do i have to clean my whole house i have to organize and i'm so like mad at myself because i told myself like last week or the week before i'm like make sure you organize this and get all this set because once school starts i am on the road a lot you guys know not allowed to go to two different schools by their mom's house so it's just a little more stressful especially with the Leia. but i feel like after disney i really just like was super in like a relaxed mode it's time to like this fire up my ass because i need to get back into routine i just want to feel good obviously i woke up this morning i made my husband's breakfast i also made lunch for the boys too and then making sure that they were obviously all set for school i'm going to show you guys the before and afters don't judge me the main thing i'm going to tackle and like really really want to get into is the boys rooms enough talking let me get my bed together you guys super freaking embarrassing but this is my room right now dirty 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 <laughs> okay guys change of plans me and baby girl are actually in the truck now i do have to run a couple errands so i was on the phone with my sister and she wants to join us <laughs> you okay but yeah she's gonna tag along so i'm gonna go pick her up we're probably gonna get like some coffee or something i was actually on I think TikTok and I was watching Wendy Ortiz like her little vlog of getting I think it's Air Wand smoothies like the super expensive like white rich girl smoothies and Alea literally told me she was like mom Dutch Bros Dutch Bros like she wanted something to drink too so I was like girl say less let's go get some Dutch Bros so that's where we're gonna go but first we're gonna go pick up my sister and then we do have to run to the bank so I will catch y'all when I'm with sissy girl. Yesterday, me and Ant were in the baby's room and we were organizing. This is the first time I took all of his clothes out from what we got from the baby shower. Uh -huh. And I was like separating them. And I was like, babe, this is what we have newborn. This is what we have zero to three, three to six. six. Like I was yeah. showing him everything. And he's like, babe, should I download the old baby app? Like, he, And he went on there and he like picked a bunch of stuff because you guys don't have a lot of clothes. Not for him, no. You guys, I have my sister. I literally was so shook right now because me and sister have obviously been like planning and talking about everything. But I feel like after her baby shower, the weeks are going by so fast. It's going by really fast, right? Like I'm literally, you guys, I'm 34 weeks and two days. And this whole pregnancy, me and sister have been talking about when, how many weeks I'm going to be when we do this, this and that. Like go get the baby stuff, go get my postpartum stuff, do my hospital bag. And right now I was telling sister, I was like, oh, I want to have my essentials and everything packed by like latest 38 weeks. She goes, no, sis, you want it packed by 30, 36 weeks. And I was like, that's in two weeks. And she started freaking out. No, I out. literally started tripping you guys because the fact that she is almost full term in less than a month in just a couple weeks is actually insane. And this is obviously her first baby. We don't know if she's going to go to 40 weeks and freaking five days like I did with yeah. Evan. Or if she's going to pop at 36, 37 weeks. So it is like so crazy that everything is just like coming so fast. But we were just talking because I really want to go shopping and get like the rest of the stuff that baby boy needs and then as far as like her postpartum just pretty much everything but like this coming weekend because she just put everything in perspective for me and i want to throw up a shit myself now because i feel like we did my baby shower pretty early like my mom wanted me to wait till like 34 36 weeks literally almost like 37 weeks for my baby shower but i was actually 30 weeks on my baby shower and really yeah <gasps> or 30 i was almost 31 that set that week i would have been 31 Oh so it's 30 and a half gosh. weeks and now i'm 34 this upcoming week in two days mm -hmm. anyways you guys this is crazy i'm just super excited i was telling my sister i have so much like peace and just like love waiting for him when he comes like i just cannot wait but i most importantly i can't wait to like 
take care of you and you also feel good after you know yeah because i know pregnancy is hard and you haven't had the worst pregnancy but also you've gone through a lot of stuff for your first time you know yeah i feel like my pregnancy has been like so happy and healthy like i've had yeah. a really good pregnancy and bless you bless you that was the only thing that happened was the one scare and it's like me falling down the stairs like yeah no i'm talking more like emotionally like oh yeah yeah like but that like shit's hard i don't know if you've seen the tiktok that i posted today but i literally put like you like you aunt and mom like healed the heart that that Stop. like you guys didn't break for my pregnancy don't cry bruh hold on what are you getting you guys were at the desk was like <gasps> okay fine you're being fake now fake well what does he want like is he craving some lemonade just a small palm beach lemonade i feel like that's your go-to when you're not in the middle but with kiwi with kiwi okay for me my school we go sugar-free with sugar-free strawberries you want to get yours Maya? yeah is that it? don't cry bruh because then you'll make me cry and i can't cry it's bad. Oh my god, wait, I'm in the ventral line. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so crazy. Thank you. Have a good day. You too, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Dutch bows, honey. Yes, baby, Tia's gonna give it to you. Here you go. Cheers, Cheers honey. Large. But anyways, standard. you guys, we are on the way home. I am still my sister for a couple hours because she is gonna come with me to pick up the boys for the first day of school because she's the best day in the world. I was supposed to drive to your house this morning, but yeah, but I feel like for like Chubb's first first day of school, kindergarten, like yeah, you know, yeah. But they already met their. You came with me literally to meet their yeah, teacher, that's true. so this morning was just like finding their teacher and like them going you know okay guys a little update we are back at my house and i didn't show you guys the before just because i got straight into like moving everything around but i did film a tiktok if you guys want to check it out i'm gonna leave my name right here if you don't follow me go follow me but yeah guys this is the little update i have all of the clothes out here i did switch out chubb's little plastic gray one are your baby sleeping you had you put four babies to sleep You're yeah super mom yeah baby she said, <laughs> but you guys this is the little plastic drawer that i'm gonna get rid of just because for one it's broken and for two i did get blessed with this one so i'm super excited because chubbs really needed the space so that's what i'm currently doing but yeah you guys i'm gonna get into all of his clothes finish all of this put all his new clothes in his drawer and i will show you guys what the end result looks like okay guys here is the outcome of the dresser it's actually a lot bigger than i expected but Chubbs finally has room for all his stuff. I do have his school clothes at the bottom and then his pajamas up here. You had a hard day, Evan? You Wait, worked so, so hard. <laughs> Do you like it? So this right here is all your shirts? pajamas or your shirts? Yeah, those are like your going out shorts, your pajama shorts and sweats. And then that's your school shorts, your school jeans. And then those are all your school shirts, your new ones and then your other school shirts. These are all like your pajama shirts and going out shirts, okay? And then up here, we're gonna put all your socks and underwear up here. I don't think that's real. I just got ready. Yeah. <laughs> I'm off. Huh? Your birthday's tomorrow, paper? you can't be mad. Cause I have to practice it. Okay, practice huh? reading the words and once you've got it down, come to me so you can show me it, okay? I did it. What happened? Did it. What is he saying? 
that he doesn't like school, but nobody, a lot of people don't. Yeah, I mean, have to go. You could do these easy years because the more you hate school, the harder it's going to be. When you're in middle school, it's going to get super hard. And when you're in high school, it's going to get extra hard. Elementary school is good, like probably the one time that you need to actually enjoy yourself. Because in middle school, you're not going to have no recess. You're not going to have nothing. Is it the schoolwork that you hate or is it the routine and that you have to be sitting the routine? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just because it's your first day. You're barely getting back from summer break. But I promise you, if you have a better attitude, everything is going to get better. Mom. What? Uh, uh, one a notebook out of a thousand. Yeah. <laughs> but you know you can't do all that if you don't work hard and enjoy school now, right? You have to, you have to work hard now so that way when you graduate or whenever, let's say you're in high school and you're like, Mom, I want a camera for my birthday to start YouTube. You're only going to be able to do all that stuff with good grades in school. Yeah. I promise you. You need to show me and Eli that you can do good in school. And I'm not sitting here telling you I need straight A's and for you to be perfect. I'm not expecting that from you, you know? I'm just expecting you to try your best and to be respectful and have good behavior. That's all I need from you. And it, it sucks right now because you just got off summer break. So you're used to having fun doing what you want. Yeah. But in reality, you're not there at school to like... Have fun. Have fun. It sucks, but you're there to learn, do your stuff, and that's it. I think that's why they're taking away a lot of recesses for schools. Yeah. Distracts kids for enough time. So when so they're not back care. in the classroom, they don't care, you know? Yeah. How many friends did you get from your last classes, or last year? A lot. A lot, yeah. See, at least you're not the new kid and, like, stressing about having no friends. At least you know people. A lot of the teachers and people in the office know you. Everyone knows you. So just be good. Do the best that you can. There's always someone in the school that has it 10 times worse than you do. Yes. Because you and your brothers and Nana, Alea, all of you guys live such a beautiful life that you just have to be thankful, okay? Because there's kids in the world that can't even go to school that wish they can go to school. You your have everything. Tomorrow. Your birthday's tomorrow. It's all in your mind. Once you be a little more appreciative and happy for what you have rather than seeing it like, oh, I hate school, I have to go to school, say I'm blessed to go to school, okay? Because Or thank God I at least have 10 minutes of free time to clear my mind. Well, if you're, yeah, if you're saying like if you're getting ready for us for middle school, Chuck is in first grade. He has like, five years until middle school and, he's, but then, Mama. and he has 10 minutes. No, I know. But they're also, like Chubbs will get used to having a long recess like you did. You were so used to having a long recess, long recess. So right now it's like, dang, I don't have a long one anymore. So maybe they're just starting it fresh for everybody to just know that you have 10 minutes of free time and that's it, you know? But it's going to be fine. You'll be good in about a week or two. Just change your mindset, and I promise you, it won't be as bad as you think it is, okay? Yeah, it'll get easier. Not my loud-ass washer in the back. But we didn't even organize any of your stuff throughout this weekend because me and Eli were out Friday, out Saturday, <laughs> out awesome. Sunday. We are super busy, so I'm going to... I did Chubb's room, now I'm going to do yours. So you're going to let me know what fits you and stuff. I'll do the organizing for you, but I just want everything to be cleared out so that... You won't stress out in the morning finding your clothes. Thank you, Mom. Mama! Mama! No! <laughs> yeah, are you loving this? <laughs> Actually, no. They do this no. all the time. <laughs> oh, no! Pick it up. Uh, -huh. uh oh, what am I stepping on? My mom. No! Yes. No! Yes. Alea, you have to share your mom. Do you, do you know that I was Evan's mama first? Yeah. So we're, we all share. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I've been Evan's mama for 10 years tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Share. Okay, I'm gonna hug Evan. Okay. <laughs> you have to share your mama, okay? Yeah. Yeah. yeah we're all. Oh, thank you. Oh, oh give her a kiss. <laughs> I love you guys. Kiss. Kiss. Oh, you want me and DK to kiss? <laughs> <laughs> That's my sister. <laughs> Holy Evan. Evan, oh, you got so many. You got I'm not even gonna lie, you, bro. You, no, you guys, I usually. I, I didn't have time for that. Was fun, mm. I was like, yeah. Not the washer, bro. You guys, I usually make sure all of this is done before they even start school, but like I said this past weekend, me and my husband were busy. We went to like two different parties. We three. Were taking three different parties. We went to 
take Brittany to the stores. We were just booked and busy, okay? So my husband built Chubb's little dresser thingy last night and it took him about an hour. But now I'm doing all of this. But I need to know what fits you and what doesn't fit you. This is how you know. Okay, Mom, Alea, look, look at both of them. She's copying him. Oh, okay. You know too? You know what's going on? Yeah. Okay. This right here no, is sis. unacceptable. Huh? She literally was staring at him and like exactly the pose that he was doing to yeah. look at you. I'm. You're yeah, gonna look at baby. it. You want your school stuff at the bottom again? It's mine. Sorry. Anything to make you not fall. Yeah. Oh. oh my god. Evan. Look at his face. Come, look at your face, bro. Go straight face to the camera. <laughs> and you guys, I cleared out his stuff like right before summer. How did it get yeah. this bad within two months? That's wild. Three three months, whatever. That's why you will wear the oh. 40 bone. Oh, like, don't cut. It's so funny, huh? It's really funny, huh? Evan, shut up before I make you do everything. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you need to tell me what fits you and doesn't fit you. It's gonna fit you no more? Is it a 16? Yeah. Banana, no, no. banana. That's an orange. Hello? She said hello. You should have banana. <laughs> I'm a seven. And shoes? So you're not a six and a half? I just got you a six and a half. And what? The vans that I bought you. Go get them, they're in my closet. It didn't fit. Oh, no, no. No, no. Those are Evan wearing it. Yeah, Those are the ones you picked, yeah? No, no. Okay, Alexis. Big? Oh! <laughs> Big joke! Joke! Evan! Oh, oh, does it fit or no? I can feel it right there. So right they're right not there. comfortable? No? No. Sis! Is the outgrew them? Like, they, they don't no. fit? I can feel that. Oh, yeah. So, a bigger size? Damn, Dude. He outgrew us fast. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I'm working with for Evan's room. It's a bunch of BS. I feel like half of this stuff he's not even fitting anymore, so I'm going to have to donate most of it. But it's nice because we're going to do a little drawer closet clean out and then put all his new stuff in here. Okay, guys, this is what we're working with. Evan has like attachment issues because half of these shorts right here he does not want to throw away and I keep telling you you have an issue look I'm trying to try stuff on but half of these shorts literally right up your butt you do not need to be wearing those they don't they fit you they, fit. they don't fit but they do. this is all stuff that but we're gonna be donating right now. Look, no you're no. gonna show her you're gonna shower okay you guys little update it's probably about an hour or two after the kids got home from school but the boys room i don't think i showed you guys it before because it was super crazy and i was getting overwhelmed i even told my sister like i'm not even gonna worry about it right now i'm just gonna do it later but the ocd in me literally didn't let me so you guys i ended up finishing the room but this is how the boys room is looking chubb's already showered and is good from school he's on the nintendo but this is his side and thank god everything's done you guys i literally have all his clothes organized and everything's good and then elijah's side too everything is done i did all of our laundry the only thing that i do have to get into first of all alaya wrote all over that which i gotta clean it but i have to clean out elijah's drawers those are his new school shirts. All of this was thrown around in the room, but I just threw it all up here for now. I'm going to get into that later. I'm honestly over it for today. Overall, the room is nice and clean. Your face. <laughs> you finished your homework? Yeah. But yeah, guys, we are going to chill for a little bit. It's been a pretty busy, busy morning. I'm going to go relax with my sister. She's in the room cuddling with Alea because Alea was throwing a fit. She has been tired and she needs a nap. But I'm going to go relax a little bit because I am hot and sweaty. Mm -hmm. 